Hello, and welcome to a tiny little unboxing all the way over from the UK. This, my friends, is a Nukon press unboxing of Charles Vess's uh, debut novel. Charles Vess, illustrator extraordinaire. He's worked with Neil Gaiman. He's worked with Ursula uh, Le Guin. He's worked with a good number of people. Especially in the small press community, he's gotten a lot of love in recent years with the fine press. Um, and he, he was always involved with uh, Stardust by Neil Gaiman from the get-go. Um, but his art was once again featured in Lyra's Books version of Stardust. And he's currently working with Conversation Tree Press's edition of Peter Pan. Anyways, this is his debut novel, The Queen of Summer's Twilight. Charles Vest. This is the signed hardcover. I don't know where to start with bubble wrap, so we're just going to dive in because it's got a little tear there. Uh, so this signed hardcover uh, sold out very quickly. Uh, so quickly that they ended up jumping the print run up. Uh, so there we go. Newcon Press, thank you for your order. Publishing high quality science fiction, fantasy, and horror since 2006. I don't know if I have anything from Newcon Press. I don't know. But uh, if I didn't, I do now. There we go, all the way from overseas. Packaging uh, leaves a little something to be desired, so we can see right off the bat there's kind of a bumped corner there. Yeah, kind of a bump on the bottom. Now, Charles Vess, illustrator extraordinaire, uh, only did the dust jacket for this. There are, I, as far as I no, there are no interior illustrations. And it's a very, very modestly priced uh, signed edition. So it's going to look kind of like a trade edition. But look at that artwork. Absolutely stunning. Uh, it is inspired by the tale of the Ballad of Tam Lin, the Scottish uh, folk tale. Uh, it deals with a young teenager uh, with a questionable past and questions in her life, getting whisked away on the back of a motorcycle by a mysterious man and crossing over from the world of Scotland to the world of fairies. And uh, there we go. Look at, look at that. Uh, the description is contemporary fantasy, Tam Lin, fairy realm. So there we go. Cover art by Charles Vess himself, the man, the myth, the legend. The book itself, oh, we got a little fairy dust on it from the shipping itself. It is kind of a bare-bones hardcover. I wasn't expecting anything too fancy, but the hardcover is sold out. I think it was originally 150 copies, got bumped up to 300. Uh, very much a trade edition. You know, it's kind of in line with a lot of the UK special editions. Not all UK special editions. SST Publications goes above and beyond. Lyra's Books is over in the UK. They're going above and beyond. Um, <clears throat> uh, Hand and Eye Press... And I letterpress is phenomenal. Uh, Erite is over in the UK. But uh, a lot of the more kind of trade UK editions kind of had the glued spine like this one does. Plain white end papers, which is fine. Oh, 250. That's what I got bumped up to. There is a signature page signed by Charles Vess. This is number 133 of 250. And he does have some little illustrations inside there. I don't think he has... He has little chapter headings. Little chapter headings. But aside from that, I don't think there are any interior illustrations. Yeah, just the chapter headings, all of which are the same. But I am fine with that. I have loved Charles Bess's artwork whenever it pops up. Oh, as well as a little some shout-outs in the back here for other Newcon Press titles. I love Charles Bess's artworks. Um, seriously, check out uh, Stardust. Um, and just the trade edition by itself should have Charles Vess's artwork in it, like the first editions. Uh, or if you can get your hands on a Lyra's book version, please do so. It is stunning. Uh, Charles Vess has been featured in the, uh, the books of Earthsea, the complete edition by Ursula Le Guin. It is stunning artwork across the whole thing. And I am very happy to have this trade edition. Well, it's, I don't want to say trade edition because it is the signed limited edition hardback. Trade edition is only in paperback. Um, I am very excited to get this first novel by Charles Vess. Uh, I, I love uh, fantasy and I love folklore. And I'm, and Charles Vess seems to kind of be 
um, bringing a modern fantasy take on classic Scottish folklore, and I'm all for it. I will have to check this out, have to give it a read, and I'll let you know what I think once uh, once I've read it. But anyways, uh, the signed edition is sold out, um, but you can get copies of the paperback edition through Nukon Press, and I'm sure there's probably going to be an ebook down the road or probably some sort of audiobook down the road or maybe even a trade uh, edition here in the States. Uh, so right now, you, Nukon Press being over in the UK, you do have to import it, or if you're watching from the UK, then you don't have to import it. There you go. But uh, yeah. Very much looking forward to diving in. Uh, anyways, thank you very much, New Compress, for the uh, the book, uh, for your business. And uh, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you around next time.